Hello, this is Al, K0CN, and we're here with the Alpha 8410 Linear Amplifier. We've unpacked the amplifier, and the next step is to install the power transformer. For the installation, we'll need to remove the amplifier's cover, and while we're inside, we'll take a look around. First of all, let me say that whenever working on the amplifier with the cover removed, that we need to be sure the power has been disconnected by removing the plug from the power main. Safety switches have also been designed in the amplifier. When the cover is removed, a switch will disconnect power to the primary of the transformer, and secondly, a crowbar circuit will short high voltage to the chassis. The first thing we note about the amplifier is that the chassis is divided into two halves, the RF side and the power supply and circuitry side. On the power supply side, we notice two circuit boards, a power main and a high voltage board. These will later be connected to the output of the high voltage transformer. On the RF side of the chassis we find the two RF amplifier tubes and the tank circuit. The tank circuit of the amplifier consists of a coil and two capacitors, one for tune and one for load. When I adjust the tune control on the front panel you can see the plates of the capacitor meshing in and out and also for the load control, you can see the plates meshing to give you varying degrees of capacitance to tune the amplifier. The coil is the inductor part of the tank circuit. The entire coil is basically used for 160 meters and the top portion is used for 10 meters and then portions in between for the other bands. As we move the band switch, we then select different taps on these coils to give us the appropriate amount of inductance. The final amplifiers are located here. There are two VTX-X118 tetrodes, which is a similar tube to the 4CX1000. The tubes are cooled using the cooling fan located here. The air is moved up through the base of the tube, through the cooling fins, and then out the chimney and out of the chassis. That's about it. That's a quick look at the Alpha 8410 linear amplifier. Thanks for watching.